Welcome, welcome, ladies and gentlemen. This is Goldsmith Gaming with me, Christopher. We're back with Hogwarts Legacy and my first playthrough game, playing as a Ravenclaw student on hard difficulty. Well, last time I kept going with a relation quests as well as some uh, minor side quests, or at least started some of them. Um, mainly we did Poppy, so we went looking for the Moonstone, and uh, we delivered the Moonstone, got information from that, but... Uh, no more from her for now. And actually, no more from anyone, that is to say, between Sebastian, Natty, and Poppy. So in this episode, what we're doing is basically keep on going with the main story. I don't want to do more side quests necessarily right now. We have a few of them, but um, I'm going to advance uh, this and go for the final keeper. So uh, Lodgok has some information. He himself uh, was planning, apparently, to stop the drill that he found, but uh, we probably should help him before he gets himself hurt. And we're in this very murky, downtrodden place here. Just gonna do that, because there's a troll about, as you can see on the dueling feet to the right there. And also, by the way, we heard from we Weeks. Is it, is it weeks? Uh, the guy with the broom, brooms, basically. We have the final upgrade ready, so we can go and fetch that one. Want to? We don't want to. Don't want to do that right now. Why, why are you moving so weirdly? Anyway, apparently getting past these guys not the worst. So, Revenium. Anyone here? No, it seems to be largely fine. Where has Lord Gok got him himself? Where are you, Mister? Wonder if Ranrock and his crew are in there. Well, that is very likely, yes. There was also a chest. No sign of Lodgok out here. He must be inside already. Lodgok's loyalty, you say? Is that what we're starting? Oh, all right. Just completely pointless uh, loot there, but all right. Find the coastal mine is where we're going. Haven't been here. New place. Again. Lovely. So, all right then. Let's make it in and see if Lodgok has indeed gotten himself into some trouble. And here we are. Feels reminiscent to the place we went through to get to this place, doesn't it? Bloody hell, it's quite big. Oh, no, 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 not that. Uh, Revelio. Revelio. Uh, there we are. There are our enemies. Look at the size of this mine. Lodgok, where are you? Don't, don't shout. Bloody hell. Something seems wrong. What could possibly be this wrong? This place is teeming with Ranrock's loyalists. Uh, I have to keep my wits about me. You're looking this way, but I think I can get past you anyway. Because we do know... This cart ought to get me deeper into the mine. very unperceptive in this game. <laughs> they are very, very unperceptive. So that's good for me. Good news for me. There we go. Past the first little bit. Items that I don't need. And you. What do you want? That is a mining cart. Yes, we can get further into the mine. Do, is that like my only option? I think it is. There was some more stuff over here. Alright, well. Our train ride it is. That doesn't feel like it's going to go well for me, is it? But uh, all right, fine. Just like Gringotts. But I'm in the driver's seat this time. Bloody hell, am I supposed to do something? Because something seems wrong. How deep will this take me? Ranrock's going to be pleased with our progress. Okay, a lot of people don't seem to be very perceptive here. Like at all. That has to be the end up ahead. Yes, it was. Now, where are we exactly? All right. Uh, okay. Yeah, indeed. They seem to be Rebellion. very, very unperceptive about the fact that someone's using the rails. And it's not them. That's, that's good job. Good job all around. Okay, what did we have here? We can light this. That goes to all the way over there. But why do I care about that? Well, okay. Oh, hello. We can also... Can we do anything with this? Nope, can't do anything with that. All right. Fine. Confringo! I wonder where these pipes go. 
I see. Thank you, game. I probably would not have figured that out myself. Uh, where can I... Can I get that from here? No, wait. Is that... Wait, is that where, where I... No, that's not where I was before. Right, no, that's not where I was before. Alright. Call me a bit confused. Call me a bit confused. I've turned something on. Uh, Alright, well, we can keep going here. here. So that's fine. So this is where I'm Rebellion. going. I did that for the future, possibly. A little bit, I'm sure. Uh, there are more stuff down there. That's where I'm going, so I did... I am very uncertain exactly what that is and what I could do with it. But let's uh, push on here. We have more people here. Big troll down there. We have assassins. Do you move? I actually don't think you do. Which means that I can easily... Oh, hello. No, no, no. They are... Oh, okay. Don't do that. They actually can discover that you know, easy game if I'm standing right next by to someone it is quite obvious that that's the one that I want to do a petrificus totalis on so why are you targeting something else game does this like all the time it's very annoying no 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 it's all fine you are very alone with two of them up there they will not see me. Oh, crap, oh, crap, oh. Damn it. That is not what I want. All right, then, fine. I think this is funny. Oh, get away no. Bombarda. No! Kill you off. You were very simple, actually. Oh, crap, I, I pressed the button. Not well enough, apparently. There we go. Get rid of you. All right, fine. A bit of fighting. It's okay. Rebellion. I do enjoy the stealth, but uh, sometimes fighting is the answer. Confringo. Go turn that on. See a Rebellion. collection chest up there, which is very long. So that brought a lift to go further down up. Is that something I want to do? I want to go up. Bloody hell, I'm not going to be able to get all of the stuff in this uh, place, am I? Uh, let's wait a little bit with that one. And move on here first. Rebellion. So there are things here too. Yeah, well, a couple of things over here. And I can absolutely go further along here. Maybe this is how we do get to the collection chest, after all. It might very well be, you know. Uh, now, what is that? Okay, basically, uh, let's do Accio. this. No. Bombarda. Bombarda. Okay. The pulsar. There we go. That worked better. I was going to say he just disappeared, but no, they didn't actually disappear. That's fine. There's also a ladder here. <laughs> You don't see me. You have no idea that I'm here. It's all fine. That's very much on a pedestal. Thank you. So that is Potionaire Tools Shelf. Lovely. Bit of a beautification that we can do when we finally build stuff. Bloody hell, I am running out of gear. I have apparently not been selling anything. Well, fine. I shall destroy, to begin with, a bunch of green stuff. I absolutely did think that I had sold things, but apparently I hadn't. My bad. Oh crap. I really wish that uh, the remaining Merlin trials that I can that I have been finding that they actually matter, but they don't because I have maxed out the challenges for Merlin trials, which is very sad because I have like 20 or 30 more to do. So I don't know why I'm doing the rest of them, and it might actually very well be that I don't. But there might be an achievement for it, so there you go. 
Anyway, there we go. Bunch of green stuff gotten rid of. Bit of victory jump for that. There we go. More green stuff. Yay. Um, so that seems to be it. No, we can open this one. To get into here. More stuff I don't need. So where are we now? Well, this is... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Well... Uh, uh, wh uh, where am I? <laughs> well, all right then. Fine. We are back here. Uh, so I've done that. That means that we should go down. But I can't go down. So that's where I'm going. Which means that we're not going there right now. Because I have gained access to this. But it could also be that this is where we're going afterwards. It's not always there. Oh, hello. So this is where they are. That's fine. Uh, there is an infamous foe here, and there are challenges for infamous foes. I haven't done them all. So Revenio. that's all fine. Are you idiots? You are idiots. The traffic is Come on, move, 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 move. So who's the... Um, is it a troll or is it that little guy? Might be the troll, you know. He looks a little bit special. It's only a fortified troll. Hello. Revenue. No, it's absolutely not the fortified troll. Is it that guy? I don't know. Uh, well, oh, 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 hello. Hello. Oh, you are actually, actually able to sort of... Are you going to keep going here? Because if you are, well, I'm going to have to kill you. You're actually moving away now. Even though you sort of vaguely saw me, you are still moving away. But that's fine. I'm not entirely sure what you're doing, the troll there, but uh, he's looking to go into the wall. So that's fine. I mean, obviously I'm going to have... I, I can't... Revenue. Most likely, at least, Petrificus to tell us a troll. So I'm not gonna. Oh crap! I think we're fine. Petrificus to tell us. Oh, gone. And I've learned in a previous episode that you can actually. Oh hello! There's also radio. So you are the guy, Grodbik. Haven't heard Revenue. your name before, so you are clearly not that important. But I've learned that you can actually, Petrificus Totalis, um, name the characters as well, which is very lovely. Now, you troll, would you mind moving a bit more? Because I'm wondering if I can get up on this pla- oh, no, yep, 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 yep. Sort of vaguely thought that that was going to happen. Oh, do you- oh, no. Okay, back up a bit. Revenue. Can I get up on that platform that he's standing on without... Rather, me. I mean, the first question is, can I even get up there? Like, is that even a possibility? Um, what we could do is just do Hello? that. So at least they are now wanting to go there. Can I... Huh. I huh. cannot get up there. Okay, fine. <laughs> so that was a no-go anyway. Uh, 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 well, okay, you know what? Screw it. Ah! Bam, he's gone. Did you seriously not no notice that? Did you seriously not notice that? <gasps> well, you're gone too, so that's fine. I know I had something back here. Yes, you did. It's me. It's me you've been looking for. Bombarder. Go, gone. So that went rather well. Your blood's on Ranrock's hands. Yes, blood on Ranrock's hands. Yes, I agree. That sort of a thing that happened. Uh, all right then. So that 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 went rather well. I do love the fact that my ancient magic is doing a lot of damage. That's just a whole bunch of. But that's not a vegan world. Uh, that's not green. It's supposed to be green when it's wigging well, not not orange. All right, fine, whatever. Uh, that's a okay. Let's just pick up that stone fire, up. which I assume I need to do to get back up. 
And there we go. Nice little excursion into the battle area to kill them. I still have some ancient magic, so if the game wants to throw some stuff at me, I will be re- Oh, crap! <laughs> Wow. <laughs> Thank you, game, for actually uh, having that system in, where they don't just jeet themselves off ledges. That's very handy sometimes. Annoying sometimes, but in occasions like this, very, very good. Okay, can I keep being stealthed? I think I can. I think I can remain stealthed here. Not so much. There we go. Let's just... <laughs> Be stealthed. The game definitely Valio. had my number on that one, but I remain stealthed. So that's fine. More unidentified stuff, which can be good. I want to say that. It can actually be good stuff. Uh, Rock is here. I only hope Lodgok doesn't cross paths with him. Is he? Is that here? Here? These are just more I. I'm starting to think that it's going to be difficult to do without a fight. I want to try it, damn it, but it's going to be tricky. Okay, I can do that, for example, as quickly as possible. Get you out of the way. There we go. Ba bam Now you are, a lot of you, moving together, which is okay. But I kind of need you that guy. So you're gonna inspect that, are you? Okay. But how long are you gonna do that for? <laughs> okay, you seem to be fine, both of you. So you're gonna now move around both of you. Where are you going exactly? Are you taking a bit of a walk? Come on, run, please, character. Hello? That's good. Oh, and... Oh, right, all right. I don't think I am in combat. But definitely more people joined the fight. But I've been... I've gotten rid of three of them. I don't know exactly why I'm playing this as a stealthy game. But there is stealth, and it's actually quite fun to do it in this game. So that's uh, one reason. Um, alright, well, you are very annoying, that guy, very annoying, but you're, no, you're moving, so that's good. I was only young, Revelio. not like I'd fall out now. Lucky if okay. I've been in one now. I think I can get, get rid of this guy. He's actually moving almost a little bit annoyingly close. Well, actually, not annoying at all, because this means that I can easily get him. Let's see, he's no, damn it. Orders. Okay, Leave your okay. accusations in someone else's direction if you don't mind. That wasn't really what I had planned. Okay. What can I use? Because I don't want to fight all of these six of them in one go. I mean, I have my plans and stuff like that. I could, by the way, set my uh, venomous tentacular Nothing as else well. Here. You noticed me a little bit. See, I'm not seeing a clear pattern to... Okay, now we're talking, now we're talking. What were what you? How close do you... Okay. Oh, hello. Why are you... Revelio. All of a sudden moving very quickly in my direction. <laughs> and where are you? I think this is good. This is good. Petrificus Titanus. No, 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 no. You saw nothing. Well, you saw a little bit. Revelio. You saw a little bit. Come and investigate. I'm for a bacon and mushroom stew. Come and investigate, because you saw something, didn't you? Uh, we do have dueling feats to use a mandrake. That's, uh, that's an easy one to do. And I kind of do want to do some more dueling feats, because, well, challenges. Uh... So you know what? Who's there? No, 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 you see, you, you, again, you see something, you see something, you should come and investigate. So we're down to four now, right? Well, actually five, I see, because there's actually two of them over there, but uh, four here. Okay, so you come and look a little bit. 
You turn around. That's good. Go, 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 go. No, this you guy. Traficus Totalis. Game. Game. You're not making it easy for me. <laughs> Always select the closest one, damn it. Uh, so you two are now coming in to check. How far do you go? Not that far. Well, actually, you weren't checking. You were actually just on patrol. That's fine. Can I? No, I can get you. No. Wow. Wow. No, I don't. Jesus Christ, game. Thank you. I wanted to pick up the Satalus, that guy. You thought that I was going to pick up potions. Good job. Are you now not moving? Either of you. Okay, you know what? At this point in time, <laughs> I'm just gonna say, why don't we just go? Uh, actually, okay, now you are moving a bit. Can I? Can I? Because I think I can. Because it's us on you. Let me ask you. Oh, crap. There we go. There we go. Do a whole bunch of that. Levioso. This also seems to be pretty simple. Oh, oh, I pressed the button, but not fast enough. Oh, 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 there we go. Bombarda. And Bombarda can explode. There we go. Dead. A little bit of fighting, a little bit of stuff, but bloody hell game. Oh. There we go. Now we can pick it up. <laughs> That's annoying. Revenue. That's really annoying. That Where sort does of... this one lead? Off the beaten path, I suspect. I mean, the game has to be able to sort of select which is the most important. Is it trying to pick up the Wigan Well potion that I can't pick up, or do a Petrificus Totalis on the enemy that's standing right next by to it? I think we all know the answer, but the game seems to be a little bit confused. Uh, so we're going obviously in there, but I see a path down, which we need to check. Obviously. Bit of stuff, bit of stuff. Gear slots are full again. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, Alright then. Well, I did pick up... Okay, you know what, let's just get rid of uh, a whole bunch of blue gloves, because none of them are ever going to be good enough. I mean, literally, the uh, purple stuff is not going to be good enough either, but uh, I'll save those for now. That's another green one. Good, good, good. Revelio. That was apparently it for this little mini excursion. All right then, let's set some more things on. Incendio should be enough fire. to light these flames. I'm well aware aware of this. You don't need to. I hope I can get to Ranrock before Logcock does. Use the bigger explosion bits. We need to do a nice little tiny one. Uh, all right then. Where do I go? I go up. Revelio. Up. Don't miss things. I think we'll do fine. Let's hide. I'm not expecting to fight um, right, Ranrock in this this episode. It feels a little bit too early for that. But it could be. Another drill is complete. The wizarding world will crumble. <laughs> I can end this right now. I have to destroy the drill and stop Ranrock's loyalists. Or just or stop Ranrock himself, or is he just gone now? Well, there's a big troll. Okay, more stealth, more stealth, more stealth. I love stealth. That's probably... Oh, do we have... I really hope they don't have one up in there, but I don't think we do. All right, then. The troll is annoyingly standing still. But these two I should be able to take by themselves, right? What are you doing? Well, you're coming here, too. Are you just a regular troll? Just an armor troll? Nothing too bad. Where are you? What do I have, by the way? Steal a Loyalist Ranger's Crossbow Bolt. That seems difficult, actually. Blow up a red barrel with Bombard. I can do that. Maurice. Let's try to remember it. I think I should be able to get both of these. The traffic is still there. No. What was that? Gone. He was I'm not alone. Actually move quite far back, I think. I cannot return now. 
apparently, because... Game? Why? Where did this come from? <laughs> Alright, I'm fine. Plot, plot relevant, etc, etc. That's okay. So you are now... Oh, ooh, you look this way a little bit. But apparently... Oh, right, yeah. Apparently I can do uh, ancient magic stuff without anyone noticing, which is fascinating. It's really fasc fascinating. Um... Yeah, you are walking with... Yeah, you know what? I am stealthy. I do that. Yeah, they have no idea. They have no idea. That's a bit hilarious, actually. <laughs> it's like, the troll is gone. Should we be worried? Should we be worried that the troll is gone? No, no, no. Let's just poke around a bit and we'll, we'll see if we find anything, but if not, well, back to normal, I suppose. Yep, there we go, <laughs> and they just, eh, it was probably nothing. And also two of our friends are gone as well. Rebellion. What happened to them? No one knows, no one cares. Uh, I do need to defeat all enemies, by the way, that is the goal for this, this room. A waste of my talents. You know what? Bombarda. You know what? That seemed fun. That, that was a fun idea the game had there. Okay. Do, yeah. That. Go. Go, and you're dead. That was a good idea, game. You only have Ranrock to blame. Where is Ranrock, by the way? I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk to him with my wand and Bombarda. Bombarda wants to talk to him. Uh, can't get up. There. That's a big. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Bombarda. There we go. Collapse pillars. I have to find a way to stop that drill. Well, this it seems like a really bad idea. You. That is unfortunate. No matter. We will build another. I found this one lurking outside. Lord Gok, come to make amends, little brother. I came to stop this. What is this you've brought me? It cannot be. All this time, you knew, you knew where it was. Don't! Are you all right? I will never understand you, Lord Gok. So gullible. That witch did not consider you an equal. She, like all wizard kind, sought only to use you. You're wrong, Ranrock. The young ones are especially deceitful. They are taught to hide their disgust for us as they exploit us. Astonishing that our ancestors ever trusted each other. All this time, looking everywhere for the final repository, searching in vain for Bragbor's last journal. Wasted my time chasing a child. And my little brother knew where it was all along. But now I don't need you. I don't need any of you. I was bringing it to you. You are a traitor to our kind. No. Lord Gok, dead by his brother's hand. No wonder he tried so hard to reason with him. 
I just say out loud to myself like an idiot, that was interesting and a bit weird from a storytelling perspective, but sure. Uh, I think that the biggest thing we could take away from that was that uh, Ranrock and uh, Rookwood doesn't necessarily seem to be seeing eye to eye with each other because uh, that was about a cadaver being thrown around. And uh, did Ranrock get out of that alive? I mean, obviously he did, but you know what I mean whole place collapsing around him and why was I destroying the pillars keeping the the roof up when I was still under it shouldn't I have been placing myself in a more secure position I don't know it is what it is all right then fine I suppose we need to get out of here so uh let's just see about now to get out of this blasted place so exit is up there but what's down here first is this where I came in? Revelio. It is where I came in. Alright, then fine. So I missed uh, some things, like a, I see a bag there. Uh, I don't care so much about the bags, so let's just get out of here. I'll send word to Fig to meet me in the map chamber. He and the keepers need to know Ranrock has that journal and knows where the final repository is. Alright, that seems like a good idea, yes. So that's done. Can we expect? Can we expect some, um, some, some, some owls from other people? If not, we are going to the map chamber. That's very true. Should I just uh, deal with you? Because I think I will. Because I need to kill trolls anyway. Just uh, go away. Yeah, nine out of ten trolls. Uh, all right then. Was that uh, was that it for quests? It was. So tell keeps around its plan. Complete the final keeper trial. That's the final bit. Let's move uh, over to the map chamber. Have a bit of a chat with the people in there. According to the owl I received, Ranrock is moving more quickly than we could have anticipated. This is grave news indeed. We had hoped for more time to discuss the best path forward. Let us hear what the student has to say. Well, I am here. Let's uh, let's talk about stuff that has been going on. Professor, you received my owl. Ranrock has the last of Bragbor's journals. He killed Loggok to get it. He knows where the last repository is. Godric's heart. Loggok. Loggok and Ranrock were brothers. Loggok was bringing the journal to me. Ranrock is a monster. We need to know where the final repository is. Surely this changes things. Ranrock has Bragbor's journals and knows where the final repository is. We obliviated Bragbor. He kept journals? Why would he have documented all of this? He didn't know what we were containing. Uh-huh. Isadora told him, yes, we have sort of figured that out, yes. Isadora told Bragbor about the magic when she asked him to build a container for her. I've seen her memories. Isadora left memories for someone to find? You know what she did? Her memories showed what she did for her father, which I also saw in Professor Rookwood's pensive. And a conversation with Bragbor in which she expressed frustration about the limits being placed on her use of ancient magic. Based upon the memories they have seen, I believe our young friend is well aware of the grave circumstances in which we find ourselves. The next trial will involve an exceptional level of magical skill and a nuanced ability to interact with beasts. Find a face of stone and tendrils. I should advise you that you must engage with any beast that is part of the trial on your own. Professor Bakar will meet you in his pensive room. An exceptional level of magical skill? Nuanced ability to interact with beasts? Hmm. I suppose we should begin our search for a face of stone and tendrils, whatever that may be. Very well. Professor Weasley has been keeping an eye on me. Perhaps we should meet there, so she has no reason to raise concerns with Professor Black. I shall see you near the coast. Perhaps then you can tell me a little more about the memories of Isadora that you witnessed. Well, all right then, and I know exactly what that means. That means the Graphorns, because they are big beasts with sort of tentacles, which is kind of odd in some ways. But uh, yes, indeed, we have absolutely more time. I don't know if I'm, if I'm gonna do 
rather start the fourth trial feels like that might take a while, but you never know. You never know. I mean, Neve's uh, trial didn't take very long, I think, as far as I can remember. We'll see. We'll uh, meet Professor Fig over at Sir Bacar's pensive chamber, wherever that is in the world. And yes, indeed, we are down in the south coast. Uh, I have been previously finding all the flu power sta pl powder stations or flu stations so we're down in this area and fig is indeed waiting for us you apparently not knew exactly You're where here. we were going i have good news we do not have any of ranrock's loyalists to contend with of course the bad news is that it's likely because they no longer need to track the keepers for information uh-huh Reasonable, and yes, those are th three. <laughs> Can't even count. Four very interesting paw marks right there. So, is this this gonna place open could up do with a bit of then? pruning. Let's look around. Okay, what are you saying? Revelio. Well, all right, I suppose. Is that a it is. I believe I know what must be done. Do you recognize the head sculpted there? It's a graphorn. It looks like a graphorn. And the prints carved into the ground lead me to believe that a graphorn will somehow open the way forward. That's what Professor Rackham meant when he spoke of my needing an ability to interact with beasts. It would seem so. I do know that the last of a long dynasty of graphorns lives nearby. They call him the Lord of the Shore. I suspect you'll need to bring him here. What happens next, I can't say. I am a hundred percent sure that I heard someone else call them Graphorn and not Graphorn. Graphorn is what I call them. I'm pretty damn sure I heard someone call them Graphorn. Uh, all right, then fine. Graphorn it is. And I do so know exactly where to go, and this is obviously the reason why that place was devoid of grab horns when I was there. So, yeah, I, I need one of my own, then. Have you ever subdued a grab horn, Professor? I have, yes. Years ago, at Stonehenge, of all places. The Ministry still owes me for that favour. It can be difficult, of course. They are massive, after all. But it's not impossible. It's my experience that many of your spells will have no real effect. You'll need to wear him down. Oh, so we actually need to sort of fight him first. It's not just bring out the bag and then you're done. Interesting. If that's what must be done, I'll do it. Excellent. I know this area well enough. When you see the remains of a large sea creature, you're in the right place. Now... Professor Rackham made it clear that you must engage with any beast that is part of this trial on your own. So I shall wish you good luck and wait for your return in the map chamber. Uh, okay, not not here. Well, okay, fine. You you basically mean do all of that and do the fourth trial, and then we will we will reconvene, so to speak. All right, then fine, and indeed. I did not even need the help of the game, because uh, the grab horn then is over here, so that is where we're going. All right then, let's see how we do this then. This is uh, curious. We can't use spells apparently, well, not all of them at least, so how do I do this? Well, we have a bit of a carcass over here, and apparently this is where we're supposed to go. This is where we're supposed to go. What am I doing here, then? This must be the place. Uh-huh. No, it's over here. I knew... I, I already knew this game. I've been here. So here we go. Okay, fine. No mounting. So not, not, we're not flying away from them. We also know that the grab one is the final uh, flying mount. If you look at the side there, that's the grab one. So... Right. Very well, Lord of the Shore. Show yourself. Hello. Well, that is the big guy. Oh, wow. Oh, that was not much time to dodge that. Oh, crap. Okay. Can I do your station magic on you? 
I can talk about this. There we go. You're a bit fun, but um attack. No, no, no. Kneel. Kneel, obviously. I need your help, friend. Bloody hell, it's big. <laughs> wow. Uh, okay, Grab Horns uh, has a powerful charge attack that deals a large amount of damage to enemies and certain barricades. Hold left trigger to initiate. Keep an eye on the Grab Horns stamina meter as charging will drain it. Intriguing. Alright. Quabam. Well, that's kind of nifty. Now. Hello. She said Sebastian promised her that I would be there if she went to meet him in the catacomb. But now he's asking her to join him immediately and to come alone. She says he doesn't sound himself. Meet us at the catacomb as soon as you can. I hope that my quill has conveyed my message clearly. It has. Alright, so we're getting the next step of various relation quests. The music is very... very elegant. And I, I said the flying amount. Clearly, this is not a flying mount. <laughs> he doesn't have any wings. This is actually a ground mount, which I wasn't um, necessarily ready for. But fun. So can I try this out on something? There we go. Start running. Here we go. There we go. Start. I need to race now, my friend. Yes, race. Where are some enemies? There we go. Quabam. All right. Well, that's kind of nifty. Yeah, I like the triumphant music here, which is fun. Uh, Alright then, Pensy. Oh, actually we are going to the Pensy Chamber, isn't that where we were? I was in so much of a chamber, really. It's more like a shore, yes. Uh, right then. Um, yeah, okay. Fine. Let's go there and just open up the place. And the triumphant music just doesn't stop. Bloody hell, game. Yes, I have the grab board. It's very awesome, but... Chill out. Chill out, dude. Okay. <laughs> wow. Uh, anyway, anyway, anyway. I also wanted to just touch on the fact that, yes, th th that whole fight became really easy with ancient magic. There's two of them and we were done. Uh, right then, let's get the uh, grab board out. How about some sightseeing? Uh-huh. Stand on thing. We need to stand specifically like that. That's going to be a little bit tricky, actually. It's not, it's not like I can wield this guy <laughs> effectively. Uh, okay, so gently now. Gently now. Is that... Is that... Are we fine? Can you stand here? Yes, okay, that's good enough. go fourth trial oh wait witness the pensive memory is that it oh um this mount yes go is it is was that it because if that's it then we can obviously just do this immediately 
or do we do, do we do a regular trial or, or was the grab horn the trial because it could be that the grab horn was the trial perhaps professor rockham was right to have had faith in you i still have my reservations isadora as you will see was not who she seemed i can only hope that you are my memories should answer any questions you may have about the power you will need to protect. Thank you, Professor Bakar. I shall see you back in the map chamber. All right, then. A little bit of an introduction there. But again, it seems to me that we are only doing this in Rebellion. nothing else. I don't think I skipped even any loot whatsoever. Well, all right, then. So that was, uh, <laughs> that was indeed the easiest of the trials so far. As I said before, you don't really know if it's going to be easy or difficult. All uh, right, then. Let's get the um, presumably final puzzle piece to this whole thing. I'm a jig and see what it is that Bakar meant when he said that Isadora isn't exactly, or rather wasn't exactly, who, he, who she seemed. Curious. All right, then. Uh, let's do this. Let's see uh, Bakar's memories. Hello? Isadora? Isadora? Son, I'm glad you're here. Isadora was not at her home. I know. Her father... Oh, Percival. What is it? It is as though he was stripped not only of his pain, but of all emotion. Everything is much worse than I feared. Neve was right. Isadora hasn't stopped. I've just learned that she has been wielding that magic on students. We must gather the others. to your common room, all right? Isadora. Everyone feels pain. And why? Because of your arrogance? Your obsession with secrets? He won't suffer any longer. Not my father. Not my students. No one. Isadora. Set down your wand. You taught me to hone my power, not throw it away. I did not teach you this. Expelliarmus! <laughs>
he's alive. Well, bloody hell. That was, uh... That was a bit fun, in some ways, but also a bit anticlimactic because, oh, big, big fighting scene in this, I want a cadaver and they're dead. <laughs> uh, but yeah, okay, I don't exactly know what he meant by her not being who she, who, who she said, or exactly how he meant, or how he said that, because that, that clearly was in line with, with what she's been doing before, but uh, going for students, uh, be it on the wrong side of the moral compass right there, yes. Alright, I'm gonna assume that something's gonna happen now that we return back to the map chamber. I don't think that everything is just gonna be hunky-dory when we get back, but uh, we'll see. We'll see what Fig makes of all of this. The caverns below Hogwarts, where you fought Isadora. Is that the location of the final repository? It is. You see... We could not destroy the strands of emotion Isadora had stolen from so many. So we did all that we could to keep them safe. We also realized that until they could be destroyed, the magic used to create them was a danger to wizard kind. Hence, we became keepers. Keepers of an unfathomable secret. We knew that someday, one with the ability to see traces of ancient magic might be seduced by its power. We built the trials to lead that person to us, to allow them to prove themselves worthy of the knowledge we'd kept hidden and the responsibility that accompanies it. Have I not proven myself, Professor? I need to get to that repository before Ranrock does. You have, and you will. But the repository is protected by powerful ancient magic, to enter, you must craft a special wand from the four artifacts you found above our pensives. So the repository is safe from Ranrock for now. If he is, as you suspect, capable of using the power of the other repository, I fear he will be able to breach our defenses. Then I must go now and craft this wand. Perhaps Mr. Ollivander will help me. Another Ollivander? I'm not surprised. As I am sure he will tell you, this wand may be used for only one purpose. Return with the wand, and we will open the way forward. I shall send an owl ahead to Ollivander. Whilst you visit him, I'll reach out to Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley? Yes. I may have made an error in judgment by not informing her of Ranrock's intentions earlier. I only hope it's not too late. If Ranrock really is going to try to drill below Hogwarts, we'll need all the help we can get. All right, Professor. I'll see you soon. Well, all right then. There we go. Trial complete. We are going to get ourselves a wand. A very powerful wand. And I gotta say, the thing that uh, Mr. Percival Rackham here just said, a bit on the odd side, isn't it? So they knew about Isadora. They knew what uh, what happened with uh, with all of that. She could wield ancient magic. She did uh, the things that she did. He himself says that uh, someone else might come come about that would be seduced by the power of ancient magic. And what do they do? They build really really tricky trials in order to test that person. I mean, if I had not met up with Fig, if none of that would have happened, really, I mean, what would have stopped me from becoming exactly like her? It's a really stupid plan, this. It's a, it's a really stupid plan. You should have just have said to me, hey, we know about everything. Here's, here's what you do to not be seduced. Instead of saying, hey, use as much ancient magic as you can possibly do, and I will try to make sure that you don't want to use ancient magic in the future. And if you do, be very sensitive about it. Uh... It all seems a bit strange, I'm not gonna lie. But alright then, so, 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 in the next episode, what do we do? Do we... I'm pretty sure I just wanna keep up with the relation, uh, the relation quests. I think, are they called relation quests? Relationships, I suppose. Relationship quests. And now that I've done that, now I am at a new level in the main story, I'm pretty sure the other ones are gonna 
come back with me as well. And I do see something very fun, which is Avada Kedavra is the, the reward for this. So who's gonna die? <laughs> Who is gonna die? It's not gonna be me, because I'm the protagonist. I don't die. Is it Sebastian? Is it Ominous? Is it someone we don't even know about? Someone's gonna die. I hope I can kill Sebastian. That would be very, very lovely. But it's probably gonna be Ominous, because he's a smaller character in the end. Well, actually, you know what? Maybe that's why it's gonna be Sebastian. I don't know. We'll see. I might actually pick this up uh, as a first point in the, uh, the beginning of the next episode. That'll be kind of fun, uh, but indeed we might uh, get more of uh, more of our friends to come and talk to us. Possibly, we shall see. For now, though, this has been Ghostmod Gaming with me, Christopher. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.